He's giving her the win. Excuse me. This is Fortnite Fails, JJ. And I want to talk about how Alinity, about a couple of days ago, was crying on stream about how she was getting a lot of hate-filled messages from a lot of different people on the net to the point of her thinking about committing suicide. And she's saying that she does not know what to do. She was thinking about quitting streaming, but she's conflicted because if she quits streaming, this is her livelihood. She's been doing it for years. And she's like, I can't control if Twitch does not um, do their jobs. She can't control whether or not um, they're fair and equal. And I'm think I'm hearing this and I'm like, it's sad that you're getting hateful messages to the point where you're thinking about committing suicide. Yeah, that's sad and all, but you did this to yourself in terms of these messages that you're getting. You keep on every time you turn around. There's some sort of mistake. There's some sort of slip up on stream. There was Im what happened. There was images on the screen that was not safe, safe for work images that popped up, and she screamed and was like, "Oh snap! I didn't know this was going to happen. It didn't get banned." Um, she accidentally exposed herself, and she was like, "Oh snap! That was an accident. Didn't get banned." Her dog sniffed her like twice. She didn't get banned. She was feeding her cat vodka. And I mean, other organizations, that got other organizations' attention. And she didn't get banned for that either. So she's done a bunch of stuff that are bannable offenses. And she's not getting banned. And she keeps on like, oh, well, I'm sorry, it's an accident happening back to back to back it's really hard for us to believe that this is an accident it's like Tarion Rain said when he was talking about the Paul brothers how they just flexing at this point it's not even it's, they're flexing at this point about how whatever happens they're going to get away with it yeah that's what Alinity is trying to practically doing it's hard to believe that it's anything else but if this is real well you need to take you need to be on the internet don't slip up for long and do this for, I don't know, several months or years. And the hate will slowly but surely go away. And then she won't have to deal with this. And she won't have to deal with this anymore. She'll be able to breathe easy. But she, again, coming back to her talking about how oh she was thinking of committing suicide because of the, her hateful messages lots of people have gotten nasty messages man and they have not thought about committing suicide at some point wouldn't you all know have to just not look at the messages man don't be in the inbox looking to get triggered or wherever it is that you're getting these messages from Sean James and a bunch of other people that was talking about how hey if you're on the internet you have to have tough skin and I mean if you can't don't have it then I guess the internet's just not for you that's the end of the video please like comment share subscribe this is Fortnite Fails JJ out